So how long have you been dealing with we this issue? We prayed for them first, and then you, okay? Two years, yeah, and then a few years. A few years, and yeah. what happened to you? Um, well, at this moment, I have, um, I have a hardware issue from teeth to my hands, from teeth and the L5 is all titanium in my back. Right. Um, from an accident. Car and, accident? Um, mm -hmm. Right. And, um, Kept getting infected, so I was in and out of hospitals before they just. Oh, that's um, okay. Yeah, she's all right. She's they, all right. Before they took out the bone, the place for the titanium. Um, the situation is now is tomorrow I go into the hospital um, because there's an actual screw. Out is that what's causing you to bend over, or it's are you always like that? Yes. No, it's right, right, right. And that's causing pain. Yeah. And, and but the bending over thing is are you bending over because of the pain in that yeah. screw? Yeah. Okay, all right. So mm. so all pain go so screw, we command that screw if it's not needed anymore, yes. disappear. Or yes, go into Lord. place right now in the name of Jesus Christ. All pain go. Yes. All pain go. All pain go in Jesus' name. Yes. And Lord, forgive them of their sins. In the name of Jesus Christ. Forgive this young man also for the situation he's in, Lord, in Jesus' name. So all, all guilt, shame, and condemnation leave right now. In Jesus' name, be healed. Be healed. Freedom, freedom, freedom. Now move freedom. around, sis. Move around, sis. Move around. Move around. And, the, and is the pain going away? Do you feel different? Do you feel lightheaded? I feel different. How do you, how do you feel different? Delight. Delight. That when when the Holy Spirit comes upon somebody, <laughs> burdens leave. Burdens leave and you feel light. Yeah. So Isn't walk a little bit this way. Walk this way a little bit. And, and you're walking straighter. You're, you're definitely walking straighter, so turn around. Turn around. And the, the pain's gone. There's no pain. So there's no pain there anymore. Yes. So right now we we so we declare that habit of leaning over to be gone also. You're going to walk straight. And and it doesn't even matter what the deal is with that screw. It don't even matter. Because when the Holy Spirit comes upon you, the screw can still stay there and have no ill effect on you. Or the Lord can take the screw. Yes. He Either will way. work however he chooses Either to way. work. So like, yeah, so we don't, we don't put any limits on the Lord. No. We, we just believe for his divine power to come right. upon people. Mm -hmm. Feels good? Isn't it amazing? I felt led to come over here. To, when you were over there, I felt led. Let me go over there and ask her if she wants prayer. I really did feel light, though. Yeah, you feel light. I felt. I, I really felt light. Yes. Right, Whoa. and it's like, and so like, <laughs> and you can feel more flexibility in your back. Yeah, I mean, I went to school. If so, I can't do that. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. It's amazing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And so you're still, Hallelujah. you're still bent over a little bit. Is that from the accident? Um. I'm just fused that way. Okay, so we declare. Until the next that, surgery, she's fused that way. I used way. to be like this. Well, so, oh, uh, yeah, she's getting better. She was like this. Well, she's getting better, and, and we're going to declare a divine surgery right now. Mm -hmm. So we declare a divine surgery right now because there's no better physician than Jesus Christ. Jesus, you He's are the, the ultimate the, physician, and you right. want her free. You right. can like, set the captain. Human physician, <laughs> physicians make mistakes. They make mistakes, but Jesus made a mistake already. But God never makes mistakes. Never. So we declare that the fusion to be gone no more no more restricting you no more restrictions in, in fact that's prophetic no more restrictions no more restrictions freedom for you in the name of jesus christ now move around a little bit and, and try and stand up straight try and stand up straight bend up bend it more like use your faith to bend it more Just, so does it, does it feel like there's less restriction? What's this button do? Oh, yeah. uh, that's to photo. Yeah. feel better. Let's you feel back. better, yeah. Yeah, like I'm not. That's, that's just for a photo. You're, you're straight. You feel, I'm not you're sure. straighter. You're definitely straighter. Because when you can, when she came over, when she was walking out of the court, she was like this. Yeah. Was like this. I was in a lot of She's much up. more upright like right now. Right. That's you're why I said, baby, get up. I need prayer. <laughs> There you go. Is that the Holy Spirit? Or? Yes, yeah, that's a manifestation Spirit. of the Holy Spirit. What wow. were you feeling? It was just like a light, like, just like a... When I was sitting over there, okay, I felt pain. I was seeing, I was barely walking, right? Right, I saw it. So we sat down, and um, I felt pain. I don't know, you brought me over here, and you did what you did, and then all of a sudden, you just 
I just felt light. I just felt like something came over me. I felt like right. just, I don't know. I and unclean spirits left also. Because unclean spirits latch on to people when, like, like, when, like you were telling me about something, an issue you had, that, there's always unclean spirits involved in that. Whenever we do something that's outside of the will of God, we're inviting evil spirits. And God doesn't want us being affected by evil spirits, but we invite them, and so we gotta get rid of them. And so, like, if you have a relationship, they can get off on you. That's why we need to walk uprightly before the Lord. We need to turn away from anything that offends Him, and we need to learn how to love. And we're all in this process. I still need to learn how to love. I still, I ask the Lord every day, Perfect your love in me so I can learn how to love everybody the way you love people. And so we're all at different levels. Yes, and I've been asking the Lord every day, conform me to your image. Every day, it's a constant growth in the Lord. How are you yeah. feeling? I feel good, actually. <laughs> I swear I do. I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> and you're so standing up straighter, always, too. I've, when I was younger, like me and my baby's father in Texas... Yeah, it's not. You're standing up straighter. Yeah, dude, they're all right here. Much straighter. Look, look, this is her back. Went to church. Where are you guys' church at? This is it. This is it. It's a legal Uh, registered church. This is called Cardboard Box Church. This is awesome. Cardboard Box Church. You got a phone number or a card? Uh, Yes, you can go on the website. Yeah, cardboardboxchurch.com. Cardboardboxchurch.com. Yeah. And you you know, you've got to take this as a hallmark in time because the Lord has sought you out. He's showing yes. you something, and he wants to draw you into a new beginning, into holiness. So now you've got to be very aware that okay, you're a couple, you've met, you've been here, you've been together for I two months. I pray for a partner. Yeah. And you need to pray right now. He needs to pray with us right now. Pray, pray. Yeah, I want, I want to see something. Oh, okay, it's very right. important right. to keep yourself sanctified. Yes. So uh, make sure you don't have any uh, intimacy outside of marriage. Oh, for sure. I don't believe that. I'm oh, good. Yeah. Oh, good. Wow, Thank that's God. awesome. It's, it's good. Wow. My, my grandparents have been made, married uh, 62 years. My mom and dad have been married incredible. 52 years. That's my incredible. Wow. Like I'm years. so happy you said that. There's another in my family. So you've got, you've got a great foundation. Yeah. And, and the <laughs> skill and the talent that God put in you as a pitcher is phenomenal talent. Yeah. It's phenomenal. It, it shows that that you are a man of precision. Yes. Yeah. All right? And so that, that's still in you. Even though you're not pitching, that gift is still in you. The, the precision right. and to know what to do right. in, in leadership. Because a pitcher is a leader of the team. Right. So, so say Good this morning. to me. Say, 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 Father in heaven. Father in heaven. I repent of all my sins. I repent of all my sins. And I receive Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. I receive Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. I want holiness in every way. I want holiness in every way. I want your Holy Spirit. I want your Holy Spirit. Direct us. Direct us. Give us favor. Give us favor. You are our everything. You are our everything. And and angels be with us also. And angels be with us also. Because you're ministering spirits. Because you're ministering spirits. Sent to serve those, to serve those who will inherit eternal life. Who will inherit eternal life. Who will inherit, who will inherit eternal life. Who will inherit eternal life. That's what angels do. They they serve the believers. So, Lord, we thank you for this young man and this young woman, and, and they, they love you, Lord, and the enemy has deceived them in certain ways, but they're going to leave it in the past. Yes. So all guilt, shame, and condemnation go and give them favor, Lord. You diminished that 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 uh, decision already in the, in the natural court, but now we're at, we're at the real court. The court of heaven is the real court. Yes, so and Jesus is your advocate. Amen. Amen. And Lord, Amen. bless this young man because he's got so much yes. compassion. He loves you. I can yes. just see how he takes care of you. Yeah. And and Lord, uh, I believe you put these two together. Yeah. Uh, surround them, Lord. <laughs> Confirmation. <Yeah>. And <laughs> when the time, when the, at the time that you have deemed into to bring them into covenant, bless their marriage, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Amen.